Hey guys, welcome back to another tarantula feeding video. In today's video, I'm going to be feeding four tarantulas from my dwarf species that I know are going to eat. The rest of them, I, I've got like a pair of the ones I'm not going to be feeding on camera are these tiny dwarfs because, let's be honest, they're not going to be eating on camera. This one because I think it's in pre malt, that one because I think it's in that one because it's a mature male, and these toy also think I'm in pre malt. So <clears throat> There's not really point in doing that. So, the smaller ones, I just chuck a couple of springtails in and they kind of eat them in their own time. But, <clears throat> I suppose they're too small to actually get on camera properly anyway for feeding. So, <clears throat> oh, there we go. So, I'm going to start off with this one, my. A male pumpkin patch. It's up at the top. Do you guys remember this one? This is the really bulky one that I really have. Oh my god, it looks stunning. Oh, yeah. Um, where are my tweezers? Oh, there they are. Right the side. So this guy, let's just give him this new one here. Let's see if we will take it from from here. Let's get the porridge off. Why is porridge attached to you? You know, I'll let that one mark that off. It's not affecting him. Um, let's go for this one then. I'm just swap hands. I'm using my. I don't know why, but I always end up holding my phone in my right hand, even though I'm right handed. I need my right hand more. Okay, I guess we're coming down first. I'll put that front there. All right. These colours are really, like, really pronounced. I reckon it wasn't long since he molted. I could be wrong. But, I do love pumpkin patches. Alright, while I'm waiting for him to eat, because he's not eating, we'll move on. Oh. doing something. No. Okay. I think you dropped that but oh look at their colours. You got a lot of pumpkin patches honestly. They're beautiful, but I guess we'll for now. He'll get round to that. This one. This one's recently malted. And its malt is in that little pot down there. But I am going to have to do a sexing with them. With all their malts. Which that should be a video that's coming out at some point when I could be asked to do it. But this guy is usually a great eater. This needs a food. This is my... Heterothele the sea whatever that says but oh sorry she as I'm showing it away but this this one is my dwarf chestnut um she gonna put the echo well I say him hopefully it's a her I really hope it's a her Enclosure back because it's easy. This one, my new holothello in and say another absolutely gorgeous tarantula. I love all of my tarantulas, but the dwarfs are definitely my favourites. 
I don't know what it is, but like, look how many of these I've got. No, you're a bit big. You are a bit smaller. You're about the right size. Right, man. Damn. Feisty one, aren't you? And let's get it out of the sun. Again, the sun's ruining it a little bit. Yeah. <clears throat> oh, I love these guys. Right then, I'll put that back after the video. So we're going to end on my mature female pumpkin patch, who is a lot bigger, and you can tell she's a lot bigger than the other, this male. So I mean, look at that size difference. This one, I'm going to find a big mealworm because. Later on today, I'm going to try a breeding. Well, that video might not come out. Um, I don't know when these videos are coming out. Like, look, a big, big meal for a big girl. There. Oh, which is, in fact, just because I know she's a bit awkward when it comes to male tarantulas. And she might try and eat him. Let's give her a second one. The more she has, the better, really. So, we'll let her get on with them. And, in the meantime, hopefully, all the males and stuff can prepare. <laughs> oh, she's definitely my, one of my biggest tranches. Because she's actually one of my biggest tranches. Mainly because out of all the tranches I've got to show, like these are obviously tiny, she can't fit in them vials. Like these ones here, they're all smaller. She's a bit bigger than this one, she's a bit bigger than that one. Them two tiny, smaller than that one. So that's one that's bigger than her. These adults are bigger than her. This one's about her size, if not maybe a little bit bigger. I don't know. And then all the rest are smaller. Oh. Apart from that one, might be bigger. But like, so I've got one, two, that might be bigger, but pretty much the same size. One, two, three, four, that are bigger. And she's my dwarf, and she's a dwarf species. So, clearly a lot of these guys have got a lot of growing to do. So anyway, thanks for watching the video. If you've got this far, then... I guess that's your problem, not mine, and I'll see you in the next one.